And God is leaving it sleepy even if it is noon in our country. It is 11 a.m. in our country. Well, in your country, it is 10. Uh, 10. Yes, it is 10. We are one hour ahead of you. What's happening with you? Hi, hello. Can you tell me about... Can you tell me about your what you were watching? I'm watching air. I have told you. Uh huh. And was it? What is it most about? Um, it is said that you can learn English with with Jane Ira 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 Ira. Oh. Hmm. Have you learned English very well from her? Huh? Well, have you learned English very well from her? It is said that you can learn English from her while watching her movie. I watched it yesterday. Oh, you watched it yesterday. What are you chapter now? Can you say it again? What are you chapter now? Chapter, chapter. You said um, you were in chap. You were in chapter what? Chapter four. Oh, chapter four. What is chapter four about? Well, um, you must watch beginning, and then you will understand. Oh, so I must understand. How about just you telling the story to me? That is nice that you can tell a story tell it to me. That is storytelling. It really is kind of early. Oh. My neck hurts. Do you sleepy? I am. Should use are you sleepy like that? Are you sleepy? Should use are if you are using the pronoun ah you um with an s and you will use do if you're using we are we sleepy? Do you um no just are are you sleepy? Are we sleepy? Am I sleepy like that? Okay, so our lesson for today is about, can you read? It's about present perfect tense and past perfect tense. Okay, we should identify what's the difference between the two. Okay, I think you know about this already, the had and the have. How about this one, the usages? Can you read the usages and explain it to me? Well, present perfect tense. To talk about things that we have experienced in life, to talk about actions which start in the past and haven't finished. Past, some past perfect tense. To talk about actions which happened before another action in the past. Okay, very good. Okay. How about this one, the forms? Can you tell me about the form? I taught you about that last night. You should use, okay, first, um, in the present perfect tense, you should say that. The present perfect tense, um, the, affirm the affirmative form is, then you will read the form plus the example. Example, then you, you, sh you should use the word while. While. In the, per, in the past perfect tense, the affirmative form is subject plus have plus verb in the past participle. Example, like that. Just like last night, can you still remember that last night? 
you're you yes yes you must say first the title and the affirmative form or the negative form then read the read the form or the structure then give an example okay okay good. i want you to learn how to speak well oh. uh the chicken still um uh. please don't mind the chicken <laughs> First, the present perfect tense, uh, the affirmative is subject plus have or has plus has participle. While in the past perfect tense, um, the affirmative is subject plus had plus past participle. In the negative, uh, read the example. Uh, example like that. Give an example. I have been at this school for 10 years. I had watched TV before I went to bed. The negative form is. Present perfect tense is subject plus have or has plus not plus past participle. Example, I haven't ever been mm, to Argentina. In the negative form of past perfect tense is subject had plus not plus past participle example i haven't ever been to argentina tara hasn't called me hadn't called me by the time i went out very good okay how about in the interrogative form in the interrogative form of the present perfect tense is have or has plus subject plus has participle. Well, in the in the interrogative form of past perfect tense, um, is had plus subject plus has participle. Example: Have you done homework? Had you studied math before you did the test? Okay, that was very good. That is very well. You should keep that up. Not two thumbs up for that. Oh, nine chicken. Okay, let, let me erase all the writings first. Hey, I saw your brother. How about the signals, the time signals? Can you tell me about the time signals of the, of the two? Present perfect tense. Already, still, ever, never. For, since, just, recently, lately, immediately. Past perfect tense is until then, by the time, period to the time, before, no, 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 after. No, no. That is prior to the time. Prior. Prior to okay. the time. Continue. After, for, as soon as, by. Before, after, when, by, by the time, by the end of past time in the past. Okay, very good. Okay, now let's practice. Okay, fill in the blanks with the appropriate simple past or present perfect. What is that? Tense. Okay, I. My dog blank my cat since I came home. Had chase or has chase? Oh. 
has faced. Can you read? My dog has chased my cat since I came home. Whoa, very good. How about this one? You look stressful Whoa. yesterday. Oh, no animated. That is she. She is very beautiful. An anime. Yes, yeah, an anime, a drawing. She's very beautiful. Okay, can you read? What's the answer? You look dressful yesterday. What? What had you done? What had? Oh, I don't know. What's the answer? Uh, what, 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 what have you done? This one or this one? Left, right. Um. The answer is this one. Bing! You look stressful yesterday. What have you done? Okay, how about this one? I blank a lot, then I felt tired. Then? I have run a lot, then I felt tired. I have? Yes? It is, I had run a lot, then I felt tired. The word, the, the clue there is here. The clue is here, okay? I felt. Yes. Okay, next. The, stre the street is full of water because it blank for three hours. Suju. The street is full of water because it still has rained for the hours. Because it had? I still choose. Was it perfect? What's the answer? The street is full of water because it has rained for three hours. The, the past participle was already done. It happened in the past and it also done in the past. While the present perfect, it happened in the past and still continue. Still continue happening in the present. Does it, does it because um, this is an... Like, in, in the fight, the street is full of water. What? What are you saying? Passing my time. Okay. You still didn't understand? Okay, let's go back to the four. Signals. We'll read the usage first. Remember the usage? The, pa the present perfect tense, it started in the past and it is still happening in the present where it, is, it haven't finished yet. While the past perfect tense, it happened in the past and done in the past. All is all in the past. Okay, how about the fourth signal? Remember the signals? If it is already, yes, it is. yet, still, never, for, since, just, recently, lately, and immediately, then it is in the present perfect tense, like that. It is mentioned before, right? While in the past perfect tense, you can see 
like that until then by the time it is also done in the past if it is if it have it started to happen in the past and done in the past well the present perfect time it started in the past and still happening right now what are you looking outside is it raining no i look at nature wow nature's you're kind of distracted okay this is the last one I what I blanked that movie before I graduated from high school. The Titans of Terror. I think, I think I have seen that movie before I graduated from high school. I think I had seen that movie before I graduated from high school. Because I see before, I think both are present perfect tense and past perfect tense. It is past perfect tense because after the conjunction, this is the conjunction, right? The verb is in the past. If it is in the present, then of course it is present perfect tense, okay? But the verb after the conjunction or the second clause is pass. Okay, I go waited. Okay, how about this one? Bonus exercise, present perfect or past simple? Uh, or past simple? Yes. Number one, my my ears hurt, so I have to do this. It's kind of gloomy. It's hot too. How about number one? Uh, yesterday. Oh. Oh. Uh, uh. Well, it's finished uh, already. We have to do this. I, um... Okay, wait. I think I told you last day that I have to show you. We will have a review of for exam. Where is it? Let me find it first. Hand it out. Advance trip four and it's no. It's not the review. Let me find the can you speak? Can you tell me a story? Can you speak? Can you tell me a story? Oh no, I listened to a story. <laughs> Are you, are you listening to the story now? <laughs> You're not focusing on our lesson? Oh, that is bad. I don't know how to describe. <laughs> um, I'm not very well in... Um, I'm not very really well in um, Vietnamese. I um, don't describe well. I don't know how to say. Oh, you can describe well. Don't you know the basic describing words? Basic describing words, the adjectives. You should learn the adjectives. Da -da 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 download. We're still downloading the review. Oh, why is it not working well? May I ask you something? Ma? What motivates you to learn English? Can you say it again? What motivates you to learn English? Um, what? <laughs> I said, what motivates you from learning English? What is 
Motivate. You don't know what is motivate? Can you write? Motivate is something that pushes you to learn. Like that. Can you spell it? Can you spell it? Wait. I will show it to you. Wait. M L T I. Oh, let me get a bad pen. What is that? Can you spell it again? Well, motivate, M-O-T-I-V-A-T-E. That means huh? M-O-T-I-V-A-T-E. V-A-T-E. Wait me a second. Sure. Well, that means to stimulate someone's interest in or enthusiasm for doing something. That means what pushes you, like that, what pushes you, what inspire you, what influence you, what leads you, what, yes, what, what encourage you to learn English. That is another term for Why is it? Why is it not moving? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, aha! Don't go. You know it already. I know. I know. Um. Well, I start studying in grade three. I don't know what English is, but um, my mother start. Start, um, start let me um, go English to an English class. Uh -huh. um, I, um, well, I very like um, the you lesson. Didn't, you didn't like it at first? I like, I very like that lesson and uh, Oh, you very like that lesson, and and I start to do homework, and I have a book that um, um that all that that um, that's all correct. Oh, all the basic grammar, right? You should know, okay? You should um, you should really how do you say that um. Practice your grammar. You should practice speaking the basic, the present simple tense, the verb, the nouns. You must know that first, so you can have. Well, um, in grade three, I um just learn present simple tense. Mm -hmm. No, you you should start learning the nouns. Nouns. What is noun? The part of speech. What is noun? What is first? What is adjective? What is adverb? Like that. You should know that first. Then, after knowing that, you can go advance. You should start at the bottom first. Yes, I know that. Okay, that is very good. Okay. What time is it? Um, what time? It's... 10.27. Okay, it is 11.27 in our country. So let's have a review. Please take note for this is our exam on Tuesday. Okay, type two, three conditional sentences. No is condition. This is, where is the passive? Hmm. Is it in passive form? Relative clause? No. Wish no. What's no. it? There's not the one. I opened the wrong 
as long or long slide. Yes. Can you tell? Can you still remember our our lesson last time? Um, number of lesson. Our lesson last time that was it start it started in the. I think lesson four. No, um, passive voice. Can you still remember what is passive voice? Yes. Yes, very good. Why is it not good in here? How about this one? What is review? It's very hot. Reported speech. Oh, there is no exam materials for you. This is very sad. I don't like this. Unit four, right? Four. Should I start? Unit one is no exam. Hmm. Hmm. I hate this. I very, very hate this. Well, you have much time. Okay, can you wait for me? Yes. Yes, thank you, very good. Uh -huh. What are you doing? I can hear voices. Are you watching? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> that's why. Okay, review passive voice. Review passive voice. Oh, oh, oh. No, this is not the one. But I think this will still be our exam. I will ask my boss about this. I will send you the list of the forms. I will send you the list of forms so that you can so you can study. Okay? Yes. Yes. Okay. Very good. Okay. It is not in here. I will just wait for the email. This and my boss said he will just email the test materials for you. I'm still waiting for them. Pantaro, what Pantaro. are you alone in home? What? Or half your brother? Are you alone? Am I alone in my own? Well, that is no, I am not alone. I have here my father, my mother, my brother, and my sister. Yes. Oh, I'm very hungry. What did you eat for breakfast? Well, um, who do you, who cooks in your family? Well, my mother cooks in my family. Um, I, actually, my father, me, my father and my mother, me, my older brother, and my older sister knows how to cook, knows how to cook, but mostly my mother cooks the breakfast, and my yes, my mother cooks the breakfast, and my brother and my sister, my older brother and my sister cooks lunch and dinner. We like we love cooking here because we like. I can't hear anything. Hello? <laughs> my mic can you, my microphone is on top of my head. My microphone is on top of my head. I keep on I keep on talking, I keep on talking and talking. I forgot that my microphone was on my head. Can we answer this again? Uh well it has answered. Oh it has answered. <laughs> How about the next one?
Um, this? What have you done? Is it have you? No. no. You're still wrong again. Hmm. I say had you. Oh, had you. Okay, how about this one? Had run. Again? Had run. Had run. Okay, good. Next is... Has rained. Has rained. Very good. Next is... Had seen. Had seen. Okay, very good. Okay. Um, huh? Okay. I will just picture this. Because um, I want to go to the comfort room, to the toilet. I must go to the toilet. Okay. Um, okay. You can leave. Uh, you can. Okay. You, see you on Tuesday. You can leave now if you want. You can continue what you're watching. Okay. Well. You can continue what you're doing. You can continue what you're watching. Okay. We end the is you are you okay? Yes. Yes. Okay. See you on Tuesday. Yes, I will just oh, wait. message you. Yes. You you say that in Tuesday we have a test? Yes, I will just don't worry, I will just message you about it. I still don't have your test material. Don't worry, I will I will inform you about that, okay? What a test? Mm, what is that test about our about our lesson the passive te the passive and the, the passive voice and the present oh. tense okay well we just review yeah so we'll do um we just had a review today and on tuesday we will be having our exam okay okay yeah. Goodbye now. I must go to the toilet. What is this? Baba. You can leave now. I must go to the toilet. I'm very sorry. That's okay. Okay. You can leave now if you want. Bye. Bye.